And also at this hour, a day after one of its founders, Nuruddin Turabi, say that executions will return to Afghanistan, the Taliban have executed four alleged kidnappers in the city of Herat and hung their bodies up in public to deter others. Witnesses say that four bodies were brought to the main square. One of them was hung from a crane, while the other three bodies were moved to other parts of the city for public display. The display of corpses in public is apparently meant to teach a lesson to kidnappers that their actions will not be tolerated. The display is the most high-profile public punishment since the Taliban swept to power last month. This is the third such incident of public executions since the Taliban returned to power. On the 31st of July, the extremists hung two alleged child kidnappers. On the 14th of September, the Taliban gunned down four alleged child kidnappers and left their bodies on the main city square for exhibition in the Mazar El Sharif uh, Square. Taliban officials claim that the alleged kidnappers were killed during a shootout and their bodies were later put on display. Herat province's deputy governor, Molawi Muhajir, said the men's corpses were displayed in various public areas to teach a lesson to other kidnappers. مار خیلی آزار میداد موضوعات اختطافی که ما در هراتیم و ملت ما اختطاف میشن و از اونا باجگیر میشه و امروز که اینا اقدام ای اقدام کردن اختطاف کردن باز اونا در درگیری کشته شدن برای اینکه درس عبرت باشه برای دیگر اختطافگران تا ملت ما رو دیگه اختطاف نکنم آزار نمید اونا به چوکا آویزان کردیم و با همه ای راه ویدا کردن اگر هر کسی هر اقدامی در مقابل ملت ما واسه باشه که اختطاف کنه یا دزدی کنه حتما به سزای اعمال خود میرسه the incident comes days after one of the Taliban's founders, Mullah Nuruddin Turabi, said the group will once again carry out executions and amputations of Hans, though perhaps not in public. Since the Taliban overrun Kabul on the 15th of August and seized control of the country, Afghans and the world have been watching to see whether they will recreate their harsh rule of the late 1990s. Public executions in Afghanistan are back. Uh, at least one alleged child kidnapper was hanged publicly at uh, Herat's Azadi Chowk by the Taliban. Uh, the Taliban claim that they have recovered the children kidnapped by him uh, from Kabul and after that uh, he was hanged. Uh, they claim, they also claim that he was a habitual offender and he was not a first timer. This is the third such incident. On the 31st of July, we first saw the Taliban hanging publicly two men in Girishk. They were also said to be uh, child kidnappers. Then about uh, uh, two weeks back, we saw the Taliban gunning down four alleged child kidnappers. Uh, they said that they were also the members of ISK and now today this incident in Herat. Uh, child kidnapping uh, as per Cigar's report is uh, uh, one of the most lucrative uh, businesses here because they end up selling children. Uh, a, B, uh, 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 the children are used for begging purposes and C, the fact that uh, uh, they can also be used for luring in and uh, be used for uh, kidnapping for ransom purposes. Anas Malik in Kabul, Afghanistan for Vion World is One.